guys, it's Jocelyn. Today I'm going to be doing a most asked middle school questions um, slash kind of a Q&A but for middle school. I came up with six questions that were most asked whenever I asked you guys to ask me questions and so yeah, let's get started. But first, hold up. If you're new and never seen my face before, hi, I'm Jocelyn. I make YouTube videos every single Saturday and starting August 5th, I will be posting two times a week for the month of August because it is my birthday month and yeah you should totally subscribe join the family we recently hit 200 way way sooner than I expected and I'm just like so thankful we could make it to 300 by the end of 2017 I believe it I believe it us so let's go question number one is the most asked question it was number one on top of my list whenever I was starting middle school is middle school hard? Middle school is just like any other year. Before you go to the next grade, you're always thinking, is that grade harder? Yes, it's going to be harder academic-wise because you are rising academically, hopefully. But middle school is like a whole different level. It's not that dramatic, but there is the small things that change. Like now you might have lockers. Now you have like different classes with different people it's perfectly fine you're gonna love it especially in sixth grade sixth grade was so fun for me and i wish i could go back so bad number two is also uh one of the top questions i had on my list when i was starting middle school will the eighth graders pick on me no the eighth graders won't pick on you they might look down upon you but they're not gonna bully you because the eighth graders are worried about their own drama and who's dating who. They're not gonna pay attention to the little sixth graders. But yeah, the eighth graders are so caught up in what the eighth graders are doing that they're not, they're not gonna pay attention to what the sixth graders are doing. And that was a fear for me because eighth graders are already at the top of the chain and I'm starting as a little baby in the school, so you know, I had this question too. Number three is, what if I'm late getting to class? In middle school, they understand like the change of going from one class in elementary school, like just staying in that class, to having multiple classes. You might not know where everything is. I remember I walked in the first day of school and I was almost late, but I had a really hard time figuring out what class I need to go to. Just ask people along the way and they'll know. Number four is what if I forget to open a locker? I definitely forgot how to open a locker. I haven't used a locker in like two years. But my best advice to you is like go to go to like Walmart or Target and get the combination locks and practice using that. My dad had an extra combination lock. So he just let me practice on that and that helped me tremendously. But if you do forget your combination or whatever, it's okay. Don't freak out. So number five, is there drama? And of course there's gonna be a drama. I mean, you stick a bunch of 10 to 14 year olds in one building, it's not gonna go down smoothly. And everybody's changing, figuring out what they wanna do. Everybody's hitting puberty. It's just a great time. And you don't wanna be caught up in drama. It's not fun for them. It's not fun for you. Number six, the final the final question will you get bullied if you don't wear makeup my sister and her friend had this question and they kept asking me so I was like just wait till the video just wait till the video no you will not get bullied for wearing makeup you won't get bullied if you are wearing makeup and if you don't I mean everybody's just worrying about themselves that's it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoy. It was a really short video, but I hope I answered your guys' questions. Again, if you're new and never seen my face before, hi, I'm Jocelyn. You should totally subscribe and turn on that bell notification. And also comment down video suggestions or contact me because I will have my social medias linked down below. I almost forgot to mention this. Um, if you want to, if you want to do a collab with me, um, the best way to contact me is either through my business email that I use strictly for YouTube or Instagram. You can just DM me. I'll have both of those also down below. I love you guys so, so much. 